Waddington, 18. Cheers, Brett. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm here with Cooper's Commercial Match Angling. I've drew Peg 18 on the arc. I've come for a midweek open. I've got four lines set up, two at 14 and a half metres for fishing hard pellets, one at six metres and one down the edge. I've come today to get an insight of the methods what are working due to a match coming up for Fish North in the 5th of June. Let's see how it goes. Right guys, we've just started the match. I've come on this 14 and a half metre line. I've tapped in about a dozen 4mm pellets, start on a 6mm on the band, but no signs yet. I'm looking around the lake, and peg 29's had two on the tip, peg 5's had a silver, but I'm going to give this line another 10 minutes, feed a couple of times, I'll get back to you. See how I am. Right, I'm half an hour in. Just started on the 14 and a half metre line. Just had my first fish. I've lost two. Started cad potting at the start, six pellets. Started getting a few liners. And now I'm just potting a few in at a time and pinging over the top. That's what they're doing when they come into the attraction, the noise on the pellets on the water. But um, as soon as I've cut the feed back, I've got a fish straight away. So I'm going to plod on with this line, see if I can get a couple of more fish off it. And hopefully rotate my lines through the match. I've been Catapulting six mils over to the far bank for my method line just to keep that primed. There's a lift bite there, something around there, something round. Just had a little bit of a dink there, like you say, three pellets at a time, cut the feed back. There was a quick bite there. So the signs that they come to the to the noise. But even though I've cut back from six pellets to maybe three or four pellets, it's what they're wanting. I keep lifting my rig up every couple of minutes, laying it out, keeping the line tight. I'm starting to get a few signs now. Lift and drop. Every so often, three pellets. There's another sign there. So there is fish moving. There's another bite there. So the fish are there. I'm just going to plod on with this line for another 10 minutes. I might have a feed in my margin to my left hand side with corner micros. Let them sit over that for a bit. I'm going to have a chuck over to the corner of the point to see if there's any fish patrolling around on that bend. But mainly, my attack is going to be long pole pinging.
there's another sign there I think we're just 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 a tad off the bottom as long as I'm getting signs I don't mind There's a bite. So keep going. It feels like you're skimming. So I want to keep on going with that line. Keep picking a few fish or keep feeding me. Nice F1. Nice chunky F1. Oh, nicely hooked. In the top lip. Reeds are moving over there, like on the method line. Just don't forget the boat, yeah. There's another little sign there. Keep plumbing along on this for a bit. Now I've got them going. Loads of fizzes just come up there. Left one, I think. Then I see F one. That's what I'm aiming for. Right, we've had a steady run on this line now, fourteen and a half meters. I'm going to continue on this line for about another 10-15 minutes till I move different lines, swap method. I might go to the method to the island. I'll catch us in a bit. joined us back now I've had a spell on the method or at the point of the island to see if there's any fish patrolling I've had I've been pinging six mils over there since I've started I've just went on it I've had a couple of liners but nothing in between that I've been pinging this line there's another fish there I've been pinging this line and this is the best line I've I've come on to pinging three or four pellets time I'm just getting a nice run of F1s now I've noticed what I need to do though I'm going to keep laying my rig in and out oh sorry mate keep laying my rig in and out <sighs> just so because the fish are watching the pellet well, there's another F1 yeah so they're definitely watching oh my hook's just come out there 
lovely F1s. There you go. Lovely fish. That pellet's alright on there, so I'm going to go straight back in. Go straight back in. Tap a few pellets in. I fed me edge line with two pots, micros and corn. I'm going to concentrate on this line, pinging a few pellets. I'll catch up with you soon. The next fish of a 14 and a half meter line just shows it's paying off. Quick change of pellet. So I think I'm gonna stick it out on this 14 meter line. I've just started pinging another 14 and a half meter line to me right to me. Try and see if I can get two swims going on them. But I'm not going to go on that line till the last two hours. So I'm going to plod on with this line, see how I go, feed me margins. I think I'm just going to forget about that method line by the time I'm going out there on the rod. I'm wasting valuable time here and I'm catching a few fish I'll feed me edge line last hour I've already given it two pots there's another sign there straight away there straight away. so they're there they're just watching the bait Bubbles coming up there, like. What? I put an extra inch on my depth. And that seems to be working better than being dead depth. Just keep lifting the rig up and down. A few pellets. I'm not forgetting. About my top two plus two line either. Oh, just a few pellets in there because that could be good later on. But I'm banking on me edge line with corn. Hopefully that pays off. But I can't really, really see a great deal being caught. Bubbles coming up. There we go again. Feed. come out, smile for the camera, lovely, there you go, this might be foul up this, just shows, take another inch off your rig, can help.
bad netting. I think it's just nicked on its cheek. I don't think it's something in its mouth. Yeah, it's not. That's telling me they've come more. They're coming more shallower. Sure. Should I take another inch off my rig? me down the edge on corner Mike Rose open to finish the match with a few decent carp I've been catching well well a few fish on that 14 and a half meter line and six mil banded pellet just going for a quick look see if it's out down this margin For a few bonus fish, like I say, hopefully, get a push straight away. But, like you say, finishing the match now, down the edge, last hour, hoping to get a few. Just see if that goes under. Got about three foot of water in me edge. I'm not right tight in. So I don't think the fish want to be right tight in in that shallower water. But hopefully we can get a few fish from this spot. Had no instant sign, just had a knock there. There's nothing major yet. <coughs> well, like you say, I've just had a bit of a knock there. So there's some fish. Rolling about, there's one, there's a fish. Only a small F1, what to fish. one there, feed a bit more corn, top it off with Mike Rose, 
all three, there's a few F1s there, but... Well. Right, I will catch up with you at the end of the match. See how I've gone on. I'll catch us in a bit. Give it. Uh, I don't think the fish are really coming in the edges. Right, I'm giving the margin another two cad pots. I'm gonna go back on that long line because I feel like I'm missing a few fish from that long line. This edge isn't pre presenting yet. So I'll give that another two cad pots full of corn and micros. I'll give it the last look, last 15 minutes or something, but I'm going back on the long line. I will catch it up with you at the end of the match. Right, it's come to the last 10 minutes or so of the match now. Come down the side. I've had a couple of F1s, a couple of skimmers, an eyed, but no decent calf. I just feel like they're not coming into that shallow water. I've got nothing else on my 14 half metre line, so I'm just chancing me chance now. Try and get a bonus fish in this edge. But like I say, we've only got 10 minutes left. So hopefully, we should have enough. I'll have about 30 pounds. The other lad on peg 27 has got around about 30 pounds, so it's not. It'll be close. So, I'm going to plod on. For the last couple of minutes, down this edge, hopefully get a cart, there's a fish. And I'll see you at the end of the match. Hopefully see what I've got. Another chub. All out! Fish on! <laughs> I wish. Yeah? Well done, Daz! Right, that is the end of the match. Finished with around about 30 ish, 32, 33 pound, I think. I've had a well, I wouldn't say a steady day, but I've picked the odd fish on my 14 half beta lines. But uh, my most productive line has been the 14 and a half beta to the left towards 10 o'clock. Been tapping in a few four mils, catty in a few four mils, fish, fish and six mil on the band. But uh, we'll see what we've weighed. I'll we'll catch up with you at the end of the match after the win.
but dug in, so it's a good way. 46.4. So what they've been saying was, I mean, they cast them more than a couple of fish together and then disappear. Yeah. Three pounds, and we do three pound ten. Forty nine, fourteen. Cheers, mate. Well Thanks to Cooper's Commercial Match Angling for filming today. I've got a brown envelope, second overall. I'm happy with that. I'll see you on the fifth of June back here for Fish North. Cheers. Yeah! Clapped it at the end. That was better. Look, that's your.